Mono Power. That's Respect by uh, the Queen of Soul, Aretha Franklin. Actually, it's not by her. She's just performing it. It was originally written by Otis Redding in 1965. And that's sound number three for ye on the Sound 11 survey from WKYC. Just for fun, just for fun. And just for fun, let's play a fantastic cover version of Respect right now by a group from Ann Arbor, Michigan called The Rationals. Big hit 1966 here in Cleveland, Ohio. I want you to dig it now. Top 10 record in Cleveland, Ohio on the Cameo label from Ann Arbor, Michigan. The Rationals and their rendition of the Otis Redding classic R-E-S-P-E-C-T on Retro Radio. Weekend weather. So far, so good. Tonight, mostly cloudy with the low around 50. Sunday, partly sunny with a high near 63 degrees. Right now in downtown Cleveland, Ohio, fair skies and 59. On Friday, May 28th from 6.30 to 9 p.m. You can join Cleveland Metro right, Parks so Institute me, uh, of the Great Outdoors for an evening of kayaking along scenic Ladue Reservoir in Geauga County. This yeah. leisurely flow will offer everything a phone call. Birds, insects, and other Frank. exciting wildlife. <laughs> Search for eagles and osprey <laughs> while enjoying the serenity yeah. of being on the water. I stay busy Search here. Just imagine if I was queued up phone. records all the time. I mean, no, f- no time for phone calls. Yeah, I know. And I still can't pick them up. Line at clevelandmetroparks.com. It's 508 in the Rock and Roll City. Let's go back to the phone lines. Hi, Retro Radio. Jumping Jaw, what's going on? This is Frank. Frank, I'm all right. Brother? What's going on? What the heck's going on with them Cavaliers? Whoa, 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 whoa. I have to, you know what? I need to go on the air and and, and propose a moratorium about Cavalier talk because we got to keep that behind us now, all right? Oh, it's a well, new day. Which is done, done right? <laughs> It's a new day. Hey, it's Saturday afternoon. We're taking a trip. We're having some good times. Don't bring us down with Cavaliers, all right, all right. I got man. Some news, though. I got some news. Yeah? Okay, um, we're doing a benefit tomorrow for this little boy, Ryan Knight. He's three years old, and uh, he's at Rainbows right now, and he has lung cancer, a rare form, and he needs to go to uh, St. Jude's in Boston. So we're doing a big benefit for him tomorrow at Marino's Bar and Grill in Wycliffe. And uh, um, it starts at 4. This is going to take place tomorrow. It starts at 4. And then at 8.30, uh, the Midnight Suns, who plays a lot of the same stuff that you play on your show, will be performing. And then after that, my band, Instigator, is going to be performing at 10 o'clock. All right, fantastic. And, of course, it goes to a good cause here. Once again, that's a benefit for Ryan Knight, who is uh, at Rainbows right now with the, with the lung cancer. Benefit at Marino's and Wickliffe starts at 4 o'clock tomorrow. Thank you, Frank, for passing that along, and that is our community service announcement for this hour here on WJCU. So, um, so I, of course, my, my wishes and thoughts and prayers are with the family right now. And I wish you, Frank, good luck tomorrow as you perform on stage at Marino's. Wednesdays, 8 to 10, is your new 80s hangout at WJCU. It's She's Got the Beat with me, Katie, your cosmic DJ. We got the beat, we got the beat, we got the I'll be rocking out to Madonna, Wham, Twisted Sister, and more. So grab your Aquanet and your spandex and come back to the future Wednesdays, 8 to 10, with She's Got the Beat on 88.7 WJCU. And now, ladies and gentlemen, Jumpin' Joe Madigan's Pick of the Week. Usually my pick of the week is something a little obscure that, that I've listened to and... That sounds pretty cool. A group from New Jersey called the Monkey Men, the Young Monkey Men. They range from, from ages 12 to 16. And they did this record. Two minute record, with never a hit, just one of those things they sold at concerts. But I did it a lot, so I thought I'd pass along and see what you guys think of it. Open the mic. Here we go.
the guitar and the Beatles all together in both channels. That's right, it's in mono, friends, and it sounds fantastic. That's Day Trip Rod Retro Radio on WJCU. Radio. Retro Radio, this must be the world famous Joe Madigan then. I don't know about world famous. I don't even know about oh, you, famous. You, right, national. How about nationally famous? <laughs> Go. You, 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 you're, you're, you're streaming you know, worldwide, so you got to read them at least. How about national wise? Well, that's true. I, in fact, I have, a hey, few, well. I have a few fans in Denmark who have checked us out on Facebook. So. Well, then that's nationally known. Yeah, but anyways, we're getting off on a tangent here. John, how you doing today? I'm fine. I got a question for you, though. Yes. As, as Tom or James would say, uh, last night was it was it just a mirage, or did I actually see Jumpin' Joe Madigan at the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame? Yes, I was there. Tommy James was there. You were there. Yep. And we all got to meet Tommy James himself. Yep, definitely. Now I take it you want to hear a Tommy James tune today. Just a mirage. Yes, great song. And as a matter of fact, as Tommy James admitted last night in the question and answer session at the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame, they were listening to I Think We're Alone Now, but they were listening to the tapes backwards, and that was the inspiration for this song, Mirage. It's number 14 this week on the Sound 11 survey from WKYC. I see you Hi, Retro Radio. Hey, Joe, it's Frank again. Hi, Frank, how you doing? Man, I'll tell you, I was just at Steeple's Drums before, and a bunch of guys came in talking about the Tommy James thing yesterday at the Rock Hall. They were raving about it. Oh, yes, it was a great time. I wish I could have made it. I've been so busy with this event that we're doing. Um, but I appreciate you putting this on. I was just wondering if you could get any uh, early yard birds on for me. All right, I'll see what I can do for you. All right. All right, very I good. You, man. All right, you take care. You too, bye. All right, bye-bye. All right. That's... For your love. Great song. Right, here's another one. Nope, oh, they hung up on me. <phone rings> they didn't want to wait around, around long enough. It's sound number 15 this week on the Sound 11 survey from WKYC, the merry-go-round and live. WKYC, fun vibrations, Radio 11. It's 5.32 in the rock and roll city of Cleveland, Ohio, and 59 degrees on the outside. The Motown sound of the Temptations, and baby, you're all I need. Oh. Let me go over your shoulder. Here we go. This time, over your shoulder. What's that? Over your shoulder this time. All right. You're all I need. Temptations from 67 on Retro All Radio on 88.7 WJCU and worldwide on the web too at WJCU.org. Weekend weather. Tonight, mostly cloudy and dark with a low around 50. Sunday, partly sunny with a high near 63. Right now, fair skies and 59 degrees. WKYC. Let's go back to the phone lines. Hi, Retro Radio. Jumpin Joe, how are you? Good, Bolly Bob. How you doing today? Oh, I'm doing all right. Just hanging out in the garage and listening to Retro Radio. But I'm um, kind of gazing up in the sky and thinking there's some history happening up there today. Oh, yeah? Um, the space shuttle Atlantis is making what's supposed to be its uh, final flight. And interestingly enough, it's taken a piece up to the uh, Russian Mir space station, which is ironic since its first flight was during the Cold War and it was a uh, classified military. So I wondered if you could play uh, Atlantis by Donovan. Yes, I could do that for you. So we're not going to go high in the sky. We're going to go way down below the ocean and travel to the lost city of Atlantis with Donovan on Retro Radio. The continent of Atlantis was an island.